Um, this is a brother I have um, actually worked with um, in that other profession in which, um, of course, is um, security. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> shout, shout out to Chef Kev 420. <laughs> Yeah, you yeah, <laughs> and and the thing about it is, though, no, literally, I, I worked with this guy, um, I've known this guy about a couple of years or so, you know, and he's doing his thing, and I'm talking about Mr. David Ocasio. What's up, bro? What's hey, up? Hey, what's up? <laughs> so, man, what? Appreciate you for having me. Appreciate you for having me, baby. <laughs> Yeah, man, I'm glad to be anywhere yeah. doing something, man. This is amazing. Yeah. So, hey, like, um, what's going on? I'm I'm understanding you doing um, a documentary. Yeah, I finished a documentary. Okay. Uh, it's called 53 Years of Resistance. So it's actually going to be my next album name, 53 Years of Resistance. So that way, if you missed it the first time, you ain't going to miss it when I do a music video to every single song. On 53 Years of Resistance. <laughs> so, you know, uh, but yeah, that's what the shirt is about, the Save People's Park. Okay. So Save People's Park, I'm broadcasting that that's a, um, the history of that is that's where the hippies and the Black Panthers meet and do things that the man doesn't know about. No, I'm just kidding. But, you know, it's a, it's a revolutionary place. It's, a, it's free. You know, it's a little piece of free land. That's why they talk about the drug problem. But, before, you know, before anybody talks to me about the drug problem for People's Park, mm -hmm. I just think about how mass incarceration for the crack epidemic was a scam. Wow. The war on drugs was a scam, wasn't it? So don't even talk to me about drugs at the park. We need free, we need places where they're free. Yeah. You feel me? Anyway, yeah, that's, so that's like a little, I didn't really touch on that in the documentary, mm -hmm. but it could be in the part two, though. Okay. Okay. So I... Um, your um, camera pursuits or, your, you know, your filming pursuits. And, uh, like, man, you guys got it. You guys got it going. Have to got it going on. And I'm talking about um, the YouTube page. Uh, yeah. Tell me about that because that should be live, though, straight up, though. I'm not going to lie. Um, I went YouTube viral on accident in 2011. I got 300,000 views. Mm -hmm. Ever since then. You'll never hear me act like everything don't need to be up on YouTube. Uh, if you type in my name, I don't have a lot of published stuff. Most, But when I throw my first, last name, or business name, I, on YouTube, people don't know. That's publishing. You're publicly publishing, time stamping. And as long as it's on a page where no one's going to erase it like a hater, then it's up there forever. Feel yeah. me? So I fuck with YouTube. Follow the YouTube, uh, Sober Gang YouTube, the... David Ocasio TV, Patreon, and YouTube. Uh, the Group Home Story, which is a movie I'm trying to work on about kids in foster care, already has a YouTube Group Home Story. You can just straight up Google that. CBG, CBD Hemp, my cannabis business. Uh, I have my commercial for my cannabis business on the separate pages. So. Okay, okay. That's what's up, man. Any other... Um any of the things you might want to, you know, want to drop, you know, like um, you do film and, you know, like. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just I'm doing off the cuff, you know, like off the cuff projects. Right, or right, just right. Shout out to uh, Black Wealth. Shout out to Rico G. Shout out to Stunner Man 02. Shout out to Mr. Fab. Shout out to Los Rockas. Shout out to Too Short. Um, just it's been a crazy winter, you know, with the camera. And I just be on my paparazzi stuff. I just be on Instagram, like, okay, well, someone's, somebody's. I seen somebody went live where Too Short was at, cause I didn't know where they was gonna be at. I went there before everyone got to their car, cause it was so, over. When I got on the live, it was over, and I brought the camera. So anyway, yeah, videography, uh, you know, news reports, some call it paparazzi work. You know what I'm saying? But just pulling up with the camera. You know what I mean? That's definitely something I've been doing for ten years now. So. Eleven, actually. All right, that's what's up. What's what's up? Shout out to the one and only Miami, Florida's Miss Mocha Bella, hey, the hey. eighth chocolate one. Hey. 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 But yeah, man. How so doing? how long you been on? How long you been doing the show? Well, um, 
damn, well, this version, shit, we've been doing this now going on almost two years. Damn. Almost two years, but I've been knowing this man since 2016. Okay. okay. And um, shit, that's January coming up. Man, that's man, that's a long time to be you know doing you know different things. I but actually edited. It together. I edited a project that's gonna drop. Don't want to say too much about it, but Igor is in it. Oh, that's what's so up. I already edited something that DJ Igor gave his opinion on about uh, you know just a documentary about Oakland. I'll just give a little piece of it. Documentary about Oakland, but yeah, DJ Igor is in it, so he'll be in the promo video. Okay. You know what I'm saying? In front of the camera, sir. That's what's up. No, I got to get my Denzel on. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Man, I wish Kev could have been here. We'd have had them Man, shout popping. out to Chef Kev 420, shout out to man. Chef Kev. At the detail shop, man. Hey. Doing his damn thing and, you know, He's making, so that, humble. Making, that, making that cheddar, bro. I'll be, like, that cheddar. I'll be like, damn, this fool got star quality. He should be in front of the camera and be like, nah. But he could, I think that fool could be an actor. Yeah. Or some, you feel me? Put him in a no, movie. No, you know, you like, know, watch that you know movie. What, though, man, cause <laughs> I, I, I'm going to give you that, man. And that's my friend, bro. And it's like, you know, his charisma, man, can, you know, can shut down a war, you know, like a, you know, can shut down a war, man. Just, you know. You know what? He be dropping damn near prepared jokes on your ass. He be like, I've been waiting to say this. Hey, listen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that motherfucker be creeping in the background. You feel me? For real, man. Damn, man. Man, but, I remember. I gotta tell the story. One time we was at work, okay, and there was a homeless person starting up a fire, and it was getting kind of serious. They was fucking around, so I'm like, I'm just getting to know Chef. Feel me? And I just see him bounce out. And he's like, Hey, you gonna put that fire out? And he's looking like. What? You like put that fire out before I beat your ass? <laughs> <laughs> that was what I was like. Oh yeah, chef. Yeah, yeah. He a real one of my coworker. <laughs> His security company's real. <laughs> that shit was hella funny though. Man, I, I I could tell you though, man. He's he's one hell of a dude though, man. And, and you know when he has your back, he's got you. And sure. you, you know in the end, and that's that's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah. So at any rate, though, man, um, can you give your um, credentials, your, your 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 credits, all the shit, you know, all your social media action, yeah, the whole nine yeah, yards? Yeah, for sure. Follow Get it Ale down, y'all. Alico Films, David Ocasio TV, Google Reggae Punk. So there's a band called Bad Brains. They're the original ah! sound. They actually do <laughs> reggae music. Okay. Yeah, this is like mixed dudes. And, and anyway, so I did reggae punk from an opposite kind of perspective. Like I have a skater voice, but I also rap, but I also fuck with reggae. So check out reggae punk. I have the whole uh, full album out on the Alico Films page. And then DJ Igor just put it on the wall. So shout out to Igor. This is a legendary. That's why I got this camera in my hand. I'm like, man, shit, this is 2022. People going to be getting to work in 2023. We already work in 2022. But we've been right. working. But as far as momentum, we're going to document milestones every, you feel me? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we're going to keep it going. I mean, DJ Igor in a documentary. Oh, damn near shit. You might have to interview him for the 53 Years of Resistance Part 2. Say something about Berkeley. That's what's up. But, um, hey, matter of fact, go Google the DJ Igor interview Oakland. It's already out. Yeah, no, I used to live in Berkeley too. Oh shit. North side, oh, Rose snap. Park, <laughs> South Side, San Pablo Park. Let's go. Okay, <laughs> hell yeah. No doubt, no doubt. So uh ladies and gentlemen, real quick before we uh get ready to get out of here, um I wanna go ahead and give a shout out to one of the segments that um has always been provided